Hello everyone, Jose Delgado here from iProtect and today we're going to be tackling a query that comes up quite often. People are a little confused around what the different consequences are of uh, if I buy a property into my name or into a close corporation or into a company or into a trust. Uh, many years ago there were different um, rates relevant to different entities that acquired uh, property. The law has changed quite some time back and for a number of years now everybody pays the same rate. So whether you buy a property into your name, into a close corporation, into a PDY Limited or into a trust, the rate is exactly the same. Uh, the minister in his budget speech just a couple of weeks ago has raised the, the, the new transfer duty rates and they're as follows. Any acquisition under 750,000 Rand, no transfer duty. Um, property acquisitions from 750,000 Rand to uh, 1.25 million is uh, 3%. From 1.25 to 1.75, it is 15,000 plus 6%. From 1.750 to uh, 2.250, it is 45,000 plus 8%. Anything over 2.25 million is 85,000 uh, plus 11% of any value over that. Uh, just to also conclude, sometimes VAT is applicable to a transaction. Uh, often you'll see advertisements that will stipulate no transfer duty. Uh, don't be duped, you are paying VAT at the rate of 14%, which is in fact higher than buying a property into your own name and paying transfer duty. The only upshot, of course, is if you're buying a property from a developer that includes VAT, the banks are going to fund that portion. So it is lighter on the pocket, or you don't have to come up with those extra duties or costs, but just note that there is VAT at 14%. Commercial properties also, a uh, different... Um, kettle of fish, you sometimes are able to zero rate uh, property transactions if the uh, property is being conducted as a letting enterprise. So you can buy one or buy a property from a seller that is a VAT vendor into an entity that is a VAT uh, vendor too and you can zero rate the transaction and there's no duty and there's also VAT charged at the zero rate. All right, so in conclusion, no difference whether you buy into your own name, a CC, a PDY or a trust, so don't let that be a factor that would uh, dissuade you from using a particular structure and also remember commercial properties uh, VAT.